apologies for the jump scare. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. I have to make the bed. I have to make the bed. <laughs> You're my sleeper girl, huh? Jump scare, two jump scares. <laughs> uh, are you gonna help at all? You need no help, I'll be honest. You're perfect. You're my baby. Hello? We had a button, come on, done. Baby into all my world. Being stalked. So just disregard that. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, cutie pies. Um, gotta get strapped up. A life-changing product. Thank you. Not one drop went down my arms, to my elbows, on the floor. They're the best. Going in with the Then I Met You Birch Milk Refining Toner. You know, when I first started using this product, the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence give me the heebie-jeebies. Snail mucin? I don't know. You know? <laughs> no. We need to move on because it's a life-changing product. <sighs> Vitamin C. I love azelaic acid to help with dark spots. This one is from Naturium. Game changer. This moisturizer is magical. This is the Dew Insta Angel Magic. It's super thick, but it melts right into the skin. So it's not leaving like a really thick night cream feel. But a lot of moisturizers that sink into my skin, they dissipate and my skin still feels dry as the Sahara Desert. Not with this cutie patootie. I just ran out of my favorite sunscreen in the whole world. So I can't show it to you today, but I'm going to show you the five empty tubes of it in my next empties video. This would be a strong second place runner up. This is the Summer Fridays Shade Drops. And then I like to mix in the Drunk Elephant Debronzy Anti-Pollution Drops. Just to give it a little warmth. Listen, I have to film something today that I can't show you yet. But if you come back here on Thursday, I will show you everything. I will tell you every single thing you need to know. Every nitty gritty detail. New year, same me. I've been taking it very easy the first week of the year because today, day one, first day of the Alive Begin Again Challenge. Was Begin Again the name inspired by Taylor Swift? Absolutely. But I've always loved the quote, with every ending comes the chance to begin again. This entire challenge just encompasses physical and mental wellness and places at the forefront. So not only do you have a 30 day progressive training program, but you also have daily inspiration or a fit tip. You have a daily task. So I've been taking it easy to prepare to take on this challenge. 30 days, every day you have a challenge, a new task to complete, and today's task is leg day. But I gotta get this thing filmed first, okay? Once again, I can't tell you what it is, so I gotta quickly do that in between this, and then we'll go hit the gym together. Listen, I'm a full-blown blowout Dyson Airwrap girl now, but on days where I really don't have the time or the patience to do my hair, this one-inch curling iron, hair toot is still my go-to because it takes me five minutes. Look at that. Anyways, it doesn't look great right now, but that's because I have to let it sit before, you know, I finger brush it. Now you don't touch it. You just let it sit here for as long as possible and then you'll brush it out. 
In the meantime, I'm gonna add some dry shampoo and some volume texture powder right here to my little roots. Listen, this is messy. This is a messy dry shampoo. But I love it. I'll show you the final hair, okay? Right now you're thinking, girl, that just doesn't look good. Just give me a moment. Okay, I'm gonna go do my makeup. I'm gonna film that little thing, and then I'll be right back. That is so cute. See how this little light blue matches this perfectly? Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna lie to you. That took a lot longer to film than, than I thought it would. Today's leg day. Legs, get it. I'm gonna wear my favorite leg day shorts with my titty bra. Don't look at my titties when I'm wearing my titty bra, but it's very titty delicious. Do I think anything bigger than a B will be able to wear this in the gym? Absolutely not. This one's for the small titty girls. <sighs> Boom. We have two jackets. Vanilla or gray? I think I'm leaning towards the gray. Let's go gray. I wouldn't call this a pump cover. I would just call it, hey, there's snow on the ground and that's not gonna stop me from wearing shorts to the gym. But, but I like that it covers my girl in the front and my cheeks in the back. Okay, honestly, these are gonna be the most plain and boring breakfast tacos. Okay, so keep your judgment to yourself. I mean, I know my girls will never judge me, <laughs> but you know I'm just throwing it out there. Okay. I need to go grocery shopping. I don't even have avocado to put on top of these breakfast tacos. And it's like, yeah, I did take a YouTube break, but nothing changed in the sense of the fact that I do still thoroughly enjoy breakfast tacos. You know what I mean? Wait, I'm also gonna have some toast. Canyon Bakehouse gluten-free bread. Um, I have a scary realization. That I've been gluten and dairy free for well, I'm still trying to figure out if it's been three years or four years, but November was either a three year or a four year. I'll do some math on that later. Of course, my almond flour CFT tortillas. <gasps> Just ignore that, okay? You didn't see that happen. Okay, I honestly feel like this is a controversial conversation but grape is my favorite artificial flavor. You know what I mean? Grape jelly, grape Jolly Ranchers, grape Airheads, grape Martinelli's, grape Gatorade. And I stand by that. I'm gonna tell you what my sister-in-law got me for Christmas. A box of grape Airheads. And no, I'm not sharing. The key with these tortillas is you can't overcook them because that's when they start to get, you know, a little fragile. So right before you think that they're done is when you should take them off. Look at this. This is perfection. That is no wrinkling and crinkling or tearing apart. The toast is the appetizer to my tacos. a journey but we made it let's head to the gym i'm gonna take you through this leg day okay i'm gonna roast and toast your glutes but like not too much okay because when you roast them and toast them too much to the point where you're so sore you can't walk it defeats the purpose because then how are you gonna stay consistent if you can't even walk the next day i made this mistake two weeks ago okay listen if there's one thing i know you're not it's that i know you're not a criminal and if you skip your warm up, you're going straight to jail. You can walk yourself there. Like, I'm not gonna lie. The gym's really busy today. First of all, I'm talking to a camera. Like, people just kind of look at you funky. You know what I mean? Pump it up. Pump, pump it up. This one's a good one. That's nice. Hips already. <laughs> all right, you guys. We have, can you see me? We have four sets of six high stance leg press. The high stance foot position is gonna make this a lot more glute biased. I'm feeling a bit intimidated, so normal leg press would be right here. We're going a little bit higher for high stance, making this glute bias. You see, that means it's go time. Three, four, one more. Turn back on. 
Okay, we have a full two minute rest. Now don't rush your rest. You need this. Nice. All right. We got him. All right, let me make sure my nipples aren't out. It is my teddy bra. All right, we're locked and loaded. We're moving in to dumbbell RDLs. I have a lot of favorite exercises. Okay, that's not true. I have like maybe three. Lateral raises and barbell RDLs, which would make dumbbell RDLs maybe third on the roster. I don't know if you guys saw, but I did spill my energy drink. I got startled by the guy taking the sled behind me. You know what I mean? Like he took the sled and I was like, well, let me move out of the way. I spilled my entire energy drink. So this is a one sip of caffeine leg workout. Six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Honestly, you guys, this is the worst part about doing a dumbbell squat is getting the weight. Lifting the weight, not a big deal. Walking with the weight, please, I'm so embarrassed. Please don't look. Don't look. <laughs> Dumbbell squat is without a doubt my favorite squat variation because this one is so glute focused. And I'm leaning forward, getting a super deep stretch in my glutes. Now listen, I'm tired of debating. I'm tired of the debate. This is not a rep. That's the stand up. This is your first rep. That's one. Two, three, eight. Yeah, just need to sit after that one. Just need to pop the squat after that one, you know? We have a loser in the gym alert. Oh, hi. <laughs> Anything you want to say to that? Uh, I feel hurt, I feel cut, but you know, we just over here putting in the work wit. It's Lizzo leg day. Same. Listen, if you see this, just mind your own business. Just mind your own business. Why carry it when you can roll it? <sighs> yeah. It's just not heavy enough, mate. It's just too heavy, mate. I have good news and I have bad news. The bad news, we have another set. The good news is the final set because we're only doing two sets at 10. I feel like a news reporter. I would argue that I barely survived. It's a strong argument, but we made it. I hope you guys are having such a happy start to new year. I have a surprise for you on Thursday, so I better see you back here. I will write the workout in the description box below and it's also on the live app. So come join the 30 day challenge. A day late, two days late, it's all right, girly. <sighs> I really miss singing on my YouTube channel. You know, when I'd be like, yeah, whoa. <sighs> but I got slaughtered. Slaughtered. And I haven't recovered from that one. See you later. I think you're amazing. I think you're the most wonderful, beautiful, best woman of the year. Okay? And 2023 is your year. I'm manifesting it for you. Okay, I'll see you next time. I love you.